Okay, so today we are going, okay, the last time we have unit 7C, pre-intermediate. So let us have here, I know we are not done with that. Okay, wait me for a minute. Okay, we are not done with the pre-intermediate, so let us go back and let us check on with it. Okay, 7C. So we talk here about honesty, right? We talk about money and we talk about, you still remember, the one who returned the money. Okay, we are done with this. Okay, and this also we are done about the story of, okay, Glenn James, okay, in which he found a lot of money. Okay, so we are done with this and also this one. I guess this one also. Okay, so here, man, I guess we are not finished with task 10. So after this, we move to unit 7B. Okay, complete the questions mean with the correct form of the verbs. Do not use any verbs more than one. So you have to use the verb once only. Please do not repeat. Number one, like this one, the answer is borrow. Okay. Does any borrow owe you money? Does you ever borrow money from your family or friends? Okay. Please try to pick the answers from the verbs to do with money here. Go mean.
Okay, let's move to unit 7D, Min. Okay, reading Aaron Levy. Okay, in seven days, still we are all still we are in unit seven, but we are now in zero four. It's a Aaron Levy reading. Okay, so look at this. You look at the photo mean. Okay, by the way, I did not share it. Sorry, mean. I'll share the photo now. Okay, please, a Aaron Levy. So we have here, uh, I can understand an article about an unusual multi-millionaire. Okay. So we have here, task one, you look at the photo. What type of company do you think Aaron Levy runs? Okay, maybe... He is considered as the multi-millionaire. Okay. Why do you think Box is a good name for this kind of company? Box Clever. Let us match. Before that, let us know some of the words. Okay, we have here the contract. It is an official written agreement. Okay, next is we've got the CEO. It's a person with the highest rank in a business company. The abbreviation for Chief Executive Officer. Next, income, of course. Income, income. that's the money that a person, a region, a country earns from work, from investing money, from business. Another, salary. Salary, it's money that employees receive for doing their job. Especially professional employees are people working in an office, usually paid every month. Investor. Investors. This is a person or an organization that invests money in something. That's investor. If I'm going to invest money in an internet, okay, that is investment. Okay, another one. Here we've got. Entrepreneur. Entrepreneur. It's again. Entrepreneur. Entrepreneur. So a person who makes money by starting or running business. Example, I have my business. I am an entrepreneur. Okay, next is profit. Okay, what do you mean by profit? profit. It's the money that you make in business. It's example, you own a water refilling station business. So the money that you earn every month that you call as profit. Another one is enormous. Enormous. It, call, it means extremely large. Another extravagant. Extravagant. It's spending a lot more money or using a lot or more of something that you can afford or than is necessary. Storage. Storage, the process of keeping something in a particular place until it is needed. The space where things can be kept. Storage, okay. Like, I have here a storage of something. This is my storage that is full of food. Uh, that's storage. Okay, here, mean. So, those are the things that will be part of the topic in the reading. Okay. So, match the highlighted words in the text with the definitions below. Some definition match with more than one word. So, imagine you can repeat the other words here. So, you can, there are only four, so you can either repeat that one. Okay, please.
money received by business or person that is okay rent income or it could be it's a salary so okay, it could be an income or it could be a salary okay money you receive every month for your work okay what is that the money that you receive every month for your work that is okay a salary okay so a business person who takes risk that is an entrepreneur okay mostly entrepreneur you are the one who becomes successful because they usually take risk okay money that a business or a person needs for a particular purpose that is what we call funding okay other term your funds if you don't have enough funds of course other people if they don't have enough funds they go to the credit the bank they will have to do credit okay because so that they will start a business okay okay please number five continue Okay, the money a business makes after paying its expenses, that is the profit. Very good. Six mean the person in charge of a large company, we call it as CEO or the chief executive officer. Okay, so another seven, formal agreements to do business, that is contract. And eight. People who support a business by lending it money, that's the investors. Okay, example, I am a millionaire. I have a lot of money. And the other, my partner or my friend doesn't have money. So I have to invest money 
for him or for the company so we can start a business together that is investors okay very good okay okay so here now mean in task three you read the first two paragraphs of the text and find the answers to the questions what type of company do you think aaron levy runs why do you think Box is a good name for this company. Please try to answer. You can write your answer okay, in the chat box using the, okay, using the, or you can find your answers in here, in this text, and please write your answer in the chat box. And refer the questions one and two. Okay, wait me for a minute, Min. I'll just go to the bathroom. Please answer.
Let us have this. Okay, your answer mean is number one. Okay, so read the first two paragraphs of the text and find the answers to this question in task one. Okay, what type of company do you think Karen Levy runs? Okay, before that, we will have to read this. Uh, we will have to read this short text about Levy. Okay. So in here, Erin Levy loves to eat tinned spaghetti, drives a 60-year-old car, and has business meetings at the takeaway. He lives in an ordinary apartment, doesn't take holidays, and at the age of 27, says his biggest luxury is his smartphone. However, as a co-founder and CEO of Box, a successful IT company, he is worth about $100 million. And he works very hard for his money. Most days, he does not leave the office until after midnight. I work so many hours because I love what I am do, what I do. I am incredibly excited about the business, say Livy. When Livy and his childhood friend Dylan Smith started their company in 2005, they had not even finished their university degrees. But grew fast because it offered a better way of storing data. And soon they had contracts with so many of the biggest company in the USA. Levy left the university with, without finishing his course. Like most new business, Box did not bring in much income at the start. Levy paid himself a salary of only $500 a month and leave obtained spaghetti and instant noodles. Sometimes he even slept there too. When Box began, Libby and Smith looked for funding. For that reason, nobody wanted to rest lending them money. They wrote letter after letter but could not find any investors. So no one ever trusted them because imagine the two of them did not finish college. They did not even finish university, yes. And so how can one, okay, how can people trust them when in fact they're still 27 years old, okay? For that reason, nobody wanted to risk lending the money. They wrote letter after letter but could not find any investors. Eventually, a well-known entrepreneur called Marx of Cuban agreed to put money into banks. Once he had decided to do that, Others followed and the business grew quickly. That was eight years ago. Now Box has grown a lot and so have its profit, making Levy a multimillionaire. But Levy says that it doesn't interest him. I am certainly not into money. I don't live in the office. Now I have an apartment, six minutes drive away, but there is no animal's house up in the hills. Otherwise, he has lunch meeting in burger bars. And I still really like thin spaghetti. I would be happy if I had it every day. So this, the start of living life, is just, he started very simple. Okay, Now he is considered as the multimillionaire, but still one of the biggest luxurious thing that he has is only his smartphone, none other than one. And considering that he is, okay, he is uh, very rich, he only lived in an ordinary apartment. Okay, so we have here the one I asked you and with questions. First, what type of company do you think Aaron Levy runs? Okay, it's a IT company. Yeah, it's IT company and it sells out and we call it the box, okay. Because, okay, why do you think Box is the good name for this kind of company? Because Box is a cloud storage company. And this app is also like a box where you can upload files, documents, and videos. Yeah, exactly. So they call it Box because their company is in computer, more on computer. 
And the co-founder and CEO of Box, a successful IT company, is worth about 100 million. However, he's not only the owner of this. He has a business partner who happened to be his childhood friend named Dylan Smith. Okay. And they started a company at around 2005. Okay. They call it Box, as what you have said, because it is a storing data. Okay. It stored up data. It stored up files. So it's everything is about technology. So the two of them maybe is very good in computer. They have, they have, uh, they have tried to make this business grow faster. But the problem is they don't have funds. They don't have money. So they are looking for someone who can help them. Not until Mark Cuban, a very well-known entrepreneur, put up the money. And the rest follow. So that was eight years ago. But now, they considered us one of the top multimillionaires. Okay? They only had, they had $100 million. So imagine that one. That is a big amount of money. So, but still, even though Livy is still a very rich, but still, he lived life in a very simple way. Still eating spaghetti and live in on in not an enormous, not big house. Okay. So thank you, Min, for answering this. Okay. Box is good name because the company offers a way of storing data. Okay. So we have here. So please write here. Read the text, match sentence A to G. We have A to G here with box one to five. There are two extra sentences. Okay, one to five here. One, two, three, four, five. You match this sentences from one to five. Okay, the same story about Aaron Levy.
do we have here? And number one, your answer is, okay. Okay, number one is letter F, correct? Number two is letter D. For two and a half years, he spent nearly all his time at his office, okay? So next one, letter E or letter A, not E, okay? Four, okay, you change, and five, letter C. Okay, you've got two mistakes. Okay, anyway, mean, we're going to, uh, we're going to, Continue this. We are not yet done. Tomorrow, mean we're going to uh, be back on reading. And this is, okay, what is this? It's task five. So on tomorrow, we're going to continue and finish task five, moving up to reading uh, 7B, okay, because we are not yet done with this. 7D, okay? So thank you so much for tonight, Min. Teacher Anne will say goodbye now because teacher has to do another activity after this. And it is quite uh, uh, late already in the Philippines. It's nearly 11 p.m., okay? So I will see you tomorrow, Min, at 6 p.m., okay? Thank you so much for tonight, Min. Goodbye. Bye. Goodbye.